Is it the case that you can invest, have great returns, and also change the world? Or is there a trade-off? Through sustainable finance and impact investing, we have a chance to help address some of the world's most pressing problems. And so I'm extremely excited to bring some of those insights and tools for doing so via this new executive education course. This is cutting edge material. There's no textbook for these ideas. Instead, what we do in this course is synthesize uh, the ideas from the latest research. Participants on the course will learn how to evaluate the return, risk, and impact of sustainable investments to also learn how to trade off profits versus purpose when choosing sustainable projects. Investors who want to generate impact, who want to change what companies do, they will have to think about the trade-off between how much of a sacrifice they are potentially willing to make on their financial returns in order to achieve other goals such as reductions in carbon emissions. One particular area that we'll study is understanding ESG metrics. And so we'll discuss what they are, we'll learn how they're designed, and most importantly, we'll learn how to design them better. This course will be led by myself and Christopher Polk. We'll also bring in several uh, practitioners as guest lecturers. I have been studying the risk-return trade-off my entire career and have advised firms on how sustainability affects that trade-off. I will draw on my own policy experience at the European Central Banks to highlight some of the key issues that arise in this area. This course is for a wide range of people. Those who are in financial services who are already working on sustainability who want to up their game a venture capitalist who's thinking about how to allocate capital across different potential investments to generate impact. It could be impact investors who are trying to influence what companies do via their investments, or it could just be people managing portfolios who are affected by risks resulting, say, from climate change. It's one of the greatest changes to the financial services industry uh, in the last two or three decades. It's hopefully gonna help us tackle one of the greatest challenges uh, in a generation, and that is the issue of climate change. And so it's great to be on the vanguard of such a change that's going to continue for years to come.